Where's the grass? The soft down the bedding? Do these dogs just sleep on the cold ground? How undignified. Great. Here comes the royal ass himself to grace us with his own knowing bullshit. What's wrong? Who- Peoria! Who is this stranger? And why is she in the middle of our camp? Hello, brother. Nice to see you too. Now's not the time for sarcasm, sister. You brought some unknown dog right into the heart of our territory. What is the meaning of this? We found Leoli. Um, the strange dog wandering our territory. She was injured, and Peoria thought it would be better to uh, bring her here and find out why she was here, you know? Instead of uh, letting her wander around by herself. She should have chased her out. She endangers our pack by bringing her here. What kind of leader- Wait, you are a Momoyo? You have no place to speak, dog! My rash sister may have brought you here, but I will drive you out- Wazi. This is no way to treat a guest. This dog is injured, and a good leader would never turn away a dog who needs help. But, Mama, we have no idea who she is, or why she is here. We need and to... we can ask her those questions after she gets treated and gets some rest. Now, come then, Fioria. Take her to the medicine cave and treat her wounds. Quasi, go meet Barquet at the southern border and report to him of the situation. Of course, mother. Why do I have to treat her? You know I'm a shitty healer. Shouldn't you do it? You're the one who wants her treated after all. That is an order, Fioria. Not from your mother, but from your queen. Take... Layali. My name is Layali, um, ma'am. Right. Take Layali into the den and treat her wounds. Yes, mama. Yeah, Fioria. You're not a pup anymore. Wazi, I thought I told you to go and meet your father. Yes, mama. So, um, should we... Let's just get this over with. So, you're a Mamoyo. Unfortunately. Get over it, it's barely a scratch. Aren't healers supposed to be a bit more compassionate? You don't know many healers, do you? My pa- I mean, no. I'm a wanderer, so I wouldn't know, I guess. Here, eat these. Ugh. These are disgusting! Shut up! These will help with the pain, I think. You think? I said I was shitty at this. Doesn't help that I hate doing it. Then why do it, if you hate it so much? Because I'm a memorial, and it's my job to heal and keep the pack strong. Strange. In my pack, a memorial chooses how they assist. Whether they're teaching, healing, hunting, fighting, there isn't really much of a role. You just do what you're good at. And what you want to do. But even if you don't like it, it's worth it to become queen of your pack. Aren't you grateful? Grateful? For what? The constant pressure, being watched and taught everything I'm doing wrong, to always have to follow the rules, always an example to be held? You are so not seeing the bigger picture here, Theo. You get to be queen. That's a gift. Oh yeah, and what do you know? You're a wanderer. And don't call me Feel. 
You don't know how lucky you are. Lucky? You are nothing but an ignorant little mutt who wandered into our territory and you think you could just preach about being a queen to me. A gift will be something I choose to accept or choose to return. This? This is a curse. Ayoria? Your wound is treated. Now go meet with Sane and Zara. I'm done dealing with you. Aeoria's right. I'm a stranger here. I have no right to lecture her. But still, being a leader, being a queen, is such an honor. She should be more grateful to be born in such a position. If I was still home, I would- Hey, Leali, you're all treated. Where's Fioria? Oh, she's still in the den. I think I said something that upset her. Don't worry about it. She's just a prickly type. Very sensitive. I'll go check on her. Why don't you and Zane head to the yearling den? That's where you'll be sleeping tonight. Xenia will probably want to talk to you in the morning. Still not talking, huh? So uncomfortable. How do these dogs even sleep? What if we can give some green grass and feather them down right now? Yes, I am far away from the meadows.